me and my daughter are the outside bloodlines that are visiting this family in this house today. And that is the unit number 24111. 24-3. I mean, that's just crazy, right? Today we're here for a prayer at my in-law's new place. I wanted to show you the synchronicity and signs and how it looks like when it's happening. So I'm going to my wardrobe to come here and everyone's dressed in this Indian sort of ethnic way. I'm just picking up like a t-shirt from Top Man. And I asked my wife, is red an auspicious color? And she goes, yeah. And I was like, okay, I'll just pick this one. As we drive up, I realize that we're giving the address to the security guard so he can open the bar barrier for us as we're driving in. As I'm driving in, I tell him, Block 24, which I just found out, which is my birthday. And Block 24 is Ruby. The name of the block is Ruby, which is the exact same color as this. And I'll show you some B-roll. If you look up, I was not gonna wear this color today. I was gonna wear black, like I usually do. Then I also realized that they basically wanted my daughter to come in and bless the house because uh, young girls are considered pure and untouched and a form of Lakshmi. Those of you Hindu would understand that. Those of you not, it's fine. It's just an auspicious uh, day and sort of, you know, bringing in the good vibes. And then the unit numbers we're giving it to the guard, I realized, is 1011. So that's 1011. So 111 is three, divine number. My company name, three part human. Three also happens to be the life path number of my daughter, who is sitting over there, sprawled on the floor, waiting to do the prayer. So how could the synchronicities and signs be crazier this day? I came here without lunch after the gym and I was a bit like in a bad mood but when I saw these I realized, oh, I was meant to be here. And for those of those non-believers who watch this video and they'll be telling you like, yeah, of course it's 24. Everyone lives in a block called 24. No, everybody doesn't. There's like a lot of blocks in the condo. <laughs> So literally, if you think about it another way, me and my daughter are the outside bloodlines that are visiting this family in this house today. And that is the unit number 24111. 24-3. I mean, that's just crazy, right? So, you know, that's, that's how you live in synchronicity and follow the signs and start to understand them. Once you start to understand the signs, you will be mind blown and they will be too obvious to miss. And then you know that you're living on path. And it's not just a human phenomenon. Plants have this all the time, like Sadhguru explained in one of his videos where when an elephant starts eating the leaves on one part of the forest, the leaves all communicate with each other and the same plant, by the, if let's say it's the same plant, uh, throughout the forest and all the leaves, they all turn bitter or produce a compound to sort of deter the animal, Eisenhower, to deter the animal from eating that plant. So that's synchronicity and how they behave. As the spiritual awakening on earth accelerates, I feel, Humans are just going to get more and more in tune with themselves and with the science, so happy following the science. Hope you enjoyed that video. We have a newsletter that goes out like once a year because <laughs> I'm notoriously bad at sending emails. Also subscribe to this channel if you enjoyed it. Hit like on the video. My name is Zephyr. All my contact details would be below. I'm not hiding on the internet. You can find me. Take care. Bye-bye.